The sum we're going to look at is 945 divided by 15. And to work this out, we're going to use what's called the bus stop method. Okay, called the bus stop method because it kind of looks like a bus stop. Okay, so our big number here, 945, that's going to go inside our bus stop there. Okay. And the number we're dividing by 15 goes on the outside. Okay. When you start doing your division, you're going to start by looking at the first number that's inside the bus stop there, and it's a 9. Well, 9 smaller than 15, so we know 15 doesn't go into 9 at all. So we could put 0 up here, but we could just leave it. Okay, and then we're going to look at the next number along. So instead of looking at how many 15s are in 9, we're going to look at how many 15s are in 94. Well, probably quite a few, but you need to know your times tables in order to do this bit. Now, not everybody could reel off the 15 times table straight off, but if you just write out your multiples of 15, we'll eventually get to a number that is or is close to 94. So here we go, 15, 30, 45, 60, just adding 15 each time, 75 and 90, okay? So 90 is just four less than 94, so that's how many 15s go into it. We count it up, one, two, three, four, five, six. There are six 15s make 90, which means there are six 15s in 94. Obviously that's 90, not 94. So the difference between 94 and 90, quick takeaway sum, is four. And I carry that forward and I'll put it in front of my five to show that the next lot of numbers that I want to see how many 15s there are in is 45. And I can go over to my table that I've already written out. I go one, two, three. 15 goes into 45 three times exactly. So I'm going to pop that up there. So the answer to what is 945 divided by 15? 63.